Always alerting, always tracking. This is Next Weather. Happy Friday. We're waking up with some dense and dangerous fog, especially Miami Dade County, where visibility has dropped to only a mile and three quarters in Homestead, down to six miles in Miami, and down to only a half mile in Key West. So just leave early and drive safely. The winds are calm or light. We have a lot of moisture in place ahead of our big cold front that's on the way for the weekend. And we are quiet for now, but a few showers will be possible. You can actually see the low clouds, the fog here from our Brickle camera, waking up to 70 in Miami. Miami 68 in Fort Lauderdale, 72 in Key West. So check out our temperatures this morning because we are in for a drastic drop in temperatures. Upper 60s, low 70s, but by tomorrow morning, the cool down begins. We'll wake up to the low to mid 60s in Broward and Dade, the upper 60s across the Keys. But wait, there's more because as we head into the afternoon tomorrow, our highs will be in the low 70s instead of the 80s. But really, it is Sunday when we are going to be feeling the chill as lows will be tumbling down to the low 50s. Certainly sweater weather for us here in South Florida and Broward and Dade. Look at Key West could even dip down to 59 degrees. And then when you factor in the wind chill, woo, it is going to feel like the mid to upper 40s possibly by Sunday morning. So again, Sunday will be our coldest start. And you know, our coldest low so far has been 52, so we could be getting close to that. Before today, still warm with some spotty showers and the strong cold front arrives tonight and then we are going to start to feel that nice cooler wintry weather as we get into tomorrow and especially by Sunday morning it'll be drier less humid as well did want to show you though that as we head into later today around noon and through the afternoon we are going to see the potential for showers and a few storms because the front will be approaching and then tomorrow we'll see some clouds around in the morning and then maybe just some peaks of sunshine as we get into the afternoon but it's going to feel oh so nice because our highs will be in the low 70s and notice as we get into next week, we warm right back up to the 80s. Now, I know I've been off the last few days, but I really haven't been because I've had mom duties, career day duties at my daughter's school, Somerset Academy Bay. You can see my daughter dressed up as a future meteorologist with her own little weather forecast. So thanks to Mrs. Suarez's class, Mrs. Diaz's class for having me, as well as my other daughter, Sophia's class, Miss Gonzalez there, and all the students that were great listeners, as well as Miss Rodriguez and all the students in her class. It was such a pleasure to speak to them about my job as a meteorologist. 